Hi, I'm Brianne Mitchell, Trigger Point Master Trainer. In this video, we'll be rolling the back of the lower leg, also known as the calf muscles. The muscles of the lower leg are prone to being tight and overactive, which may cause improper movement from the ankle all the way up to the hip. After activity, foam rolling the lower leg can help improve movement and reduce soreness by speeding up your recovery time. To best address the calves, we're going to divide the area into two zones. Zone one will be the inside of the lower leg from the ankle to just below the knee. Zone two will be the outside of the lower leg, again, from the ankle to just below the knee. To get started, we're gonna go ahead and place the foot on the core roller. Now please note, you can always do this with two legs for a little decrease in pressure. You can do it with a single leg, or for our purposes, I'm gonna show you with one leg on top for added pressure. To get started, we're gonna internally rotate the leg, placing the hands by the sides and slightly outward. We're gonna place the left leg on top, lift the hips, make sure to take a deep breath in and we're gonna roll four times through zone one. Remember, if you feel any tender spot, you can stop and hold for 20 seconds. We're gonna begin our four rolls. One, two, three, moving at one inch per second, four. We'll now move in to your four cross frictions. The first set will be at the bottom of zone one. So we keep the foot and leg internally rotated, drop the hips, keeping the hands by the side, and we're gonna move side to side four times. One, two, three, four. Next, we move to the top of zone one, and we'll complete another set of four cross frictions. One, two, three, four. Now we're gonna move on to zone two of the lower leg. We're gonna externally rotate the leg, left leg over on top, and we're gonna lift the body up. And again, roll four times through zone two. One. Exhale, two. Three, and four. We'll now move into your four cross frictions of zone two. Starting at the base of zone two, we lower the hips to the ground and move side to side four times. One, two, three, four. We'll now move to the top of zone two and complete another set of four cross frictions. One, two, three, four. That will complete the lower leg. Let's move on. 